You're watching a Disney World employee fending off an alligator at one of the Magic Kingdom's most popular attractions, Splash Mountain. The guy pokes the gator with a pole, attempting to force it back into the water. But the gator is determined to come on land. Just a few feet away, tourists are enjoying the ride, oblivious to the danger. The disturbing video is surfacing as a new report claims Disney ignored warnings that guests staying at the swanky Bora Bora bungalows were known to frequently feed gators in the same lagoon where two-year-old Lane Graves lost his life. The luxurious private villas at Disney's Polynesian Resort rent for $2,000 a night. They were built on stilts over the Seven Seas Lagoon. Check out the view from the private balcony. There's the Magic Kingdom, and that's the Grand Floridian Resort, where Lane Graves was staying with his family. Disney has known about the problem of guests feeding the alligators, a former employee told the rap.com. He says he recommended a fence should be erected to protect guests, but he claims his warnings fell on deaf ears. Oh my God, a real gator! Guests have been seen feeding gators all over Disney World. This video was shot at the Coronado Springs Resort. It shows kids throwing chicken and lettuce at an alligator. The just released autopsy report ruled that Lane Graves died from drowning and traumatic injuries. His parents said in a statement, words cannot describe the shock and grief our family is experiencing over the loss of our son. We are devastated.